this would be quite the ride in Loreto. Uh, if you just imagine this uh, uh, zipping down the Paseo, um, all us Loreto Bay homeowners just need one of these and uh, I think we'd be the coolest ones in town. After seeing a uh, glowing Buddha, I thought that that was going to be the most interesting thing. And now we actually have this rolling um, ball in the middle of the street. And it also has uh, quite a bit of lights in it. Um, I'm not sure who's the one that's actually controlling this um, uh, contraption. Should I just walk up to it? Semi-autonomous robots with their own swarming behavior. They have their own GPS system, but they have no way of seeing you. They have only a way of seeing each other and where they are in the world. We have, I see. We have six total. We brought three tonight. We okay. only have two rolling around at a time this because of the small space. I see. And how many people worked on this project? 25 to 30 people. Uh, okay. I'm an artist by trade, so I helped uh, build them, just weld them together. Soldering, lots of soldering involved. Um, <laughs> Lots of programming. So how long did this whole project take? We're still working on it. It's, we're, I think we're in our second year, third year, 2007. So this will be, be our third year. Oh, wow. We're trying, what we're working on now is now that we have the, the prototypes of the swarm, the six uh, orbs, and so many people have said, you know, I'd really like to be able to do this ourselves. So we're working on a way of creating a list, uh, a kit, a list of things that you can buy from your local hardware store to be able to, to, be do able this. to make a robot uh -huh. that has its own flocking behavior just like these guys do. So you can download to the onboard computer, you can get a, um, we're working on uh, uh, a software, software basically, basically that you can download off the internet and you can control them using a wireless computer. Oh, nice. So are these sort of for people that just enjoy the fun and watching them or are there practical applications you're looking at? We're not, this is an art project. There okay. was no, there's a <laughs> lot of people that have seen, you know, robots. Robots always have to have a, a task that they perform. Yeah, interesting. Well, art in itself is a process. It is in itself a task. 